Marcy, with Ash Wednesday tomorrow, immigrant advocacy group La Unión del Pueblo Entero will begin a 40-day fast chain, all in response to the federal judge's ruling against President Obama's deferred action programs. Just one day before President Obama's expanded deferred action program was supposed to open to thousands of more undocumented children, dreamers will have to wait a little longer. This comes after a Brownsville federal judge issued a preliminary injunction to the president's deferred action programs. Lupe Communications Coordinator John Michael Torres says it's disappointing, but doesn't come as a surprise. We know this, this is only a temporary setback. Um, this judge was specifically picked because of how conservative and how anti-immigrant he is, um, and to give the chance, the, the lawsuit a chance to advance. But it's not going to get passed. We know that it's eventually it's going to be thrown out. Um, the lawsuit doesn't have legal merit. If DACA or DAPA is to go into effect before the federal case is heard, the Fifth Circuit Court of Appeals will need to act. We know that eventually people will be able to apply for these programs um, because there's nothing un unconstitutional about them. Um, but this, the longer that the Fifth Circuit uh, Court takes to decide on this matter, uh, the more confusion there's going to be in the community. Local state legislators are unhappy with the latest developments. State Representative Oscar Longoria says it would benefit the South Texas community tenfold. Those who qualified for DACA in 2012 will be able to reapply. But parents and those who only qualify in DACA's expansion will have no choice but to wait. It benefits. There are so many people who will be able to then to come out of the shadows to to pay taxes, uh, to be able to work and stay with their families. Uh, we know that eventually the the programs will have success. Lupe's members will begin fasting tomorrow morning and take turns for the next 40 days, ending on March 28th the day of Lupe's annual Cesar Chavez March. Live in San Juan, Brett Crandall, Action 4 News.